huge news, super exciting news. I'm so happy about this because so it's such happy. a feel good show. Nobody wants this was renewed for a second season. If you haven't watched it already, nobody wants this is the rom com on Netflix uh, between Kristen Bell and Adam Brody. She's a podcaster. He's a rabbi. She is learning about his religion. It's it's very beautiful. It's so romantic. I think it's relatable for a lot of for a lot of people watching who have been in and out of relationships. Like I just loved this show so much and I am so 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 ecstatic that they are getting a second season and I'm really happy for the Fosters I feel like Erin Foster has talked about how much she's put into this Mm -hmm. show she's talked about um the background of selling it to Netflix how she originally sold it as herself starring it and they were like that's adorable um but obviously she got Kristen Bell and it's amazing to get like such an A-list actress to be playing what is supposed to be like your role kind of um it's such a beautiful story and I'm really so obsessed with this show and I'm so 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 happy i couldn't be happier they're getting a second season because i I, it just wasn't enough like i want more same i i agree i cannot wait um i did see the deadline announcement said they added uh two new showrunners which Mm. was interesting i don't know if that's like something that normally happens or or i mean er, like aaron foster re shared the video and was like we're coming back so like i'm Mm -hmm. obviously i'm sure that means she's uh, it's her show involved um but i guess maybe there's like timing things or book scheduling things if they have to like bring other people in or or whatever it is but i i loved it's the one thing that i actually like watched while i was gone i um made sure like here they're like traveling on planes stuff such an easy Mm -hmm. it was such an easy watch so easy um and and then my tiktok has just been all Adam Brody. Ugh, it's just all Adam Brody. Literally melts I could, my heart in the show. I just, I could not be happier for an Adam Brody renaissance. Mm-hmm. It's just Seth Cohen. He and he's and he's just kind of the same. He's he's, he's just, just a grown up Seth Cohen. Like it's and just nobody kind of the same. Um, yeah, it's really it's such a it's a he plays such a great character and he I mean he's adorable and all of his interviews I mean he's so freaking cute. They're they have such chemistry. I'm they so do. happy that they, they paired these two together and we were brought such chemistry on our screen that you really root for and that you really buy into and yeah. and such great actors and actresses with such a background. Like I love seeing newcomers. Absolutely. I love when we yeah. see a new star on our screen. But that like nostalgic feeling of watching Adam Brody and Kristen Bell in a beautiful rom com, it, it was spectacular. I, and I couldn't be happier. Same. I'm so happy about it too. I said bef- <laughs> when I saw the news, I said, Oh, they they got renewed for a second season and Noah was like, wow, didn't even cross my mind that they would even like try and do a second season. I was like, what? Yes. What do you mean? You can't believe that they would. No, no, that's not why. And but I, he I was don't like want... talking about the ending. I don't and, like, spoil Not the to ending. spoil anything, but I, I thought that the ending was so open ended of... that there could be so much. Like, I was like, yeah. oh, second season for sure. I agree. When I, I totally watched the agree. ending, I was just like, oh, like, ha- well, I don't want to spoil it. Yeah. But, like, I was just like, oh, that ra- they wrapped it up. Like, oh, I, 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 I couldn't have thought more of the opposite. <laughs> yeah, I thought it was pretty open ended <laughs> to the point where I thought I didn't finish the yeah, show. Yeah, right. Same. Like, I thought I had another I like, episode. I was like, oh my God, what? Like, I was like, that's where they're going to end no, it? No, I, the next day, was like, wait, we have to finish. Nobody wants yeah. this. And Matt was like, no, we finished it. And I was like, wait, what do you mean? That's yeah. it? You're like, like, that was the end? That was the end. So I totally agree that they could so have done second more. season. And I also think that this show, not only is it a beautiful rom-com, but it also brings up um, new conversations, like conversation about religion and relationships mm-hmm. and and different aspects of life that be, can be considered heavily in relationships yeah, that yeah. I don't know if we see often in like a rom-com or a TV show. And um, I just thought it was like, perfectly executed yeah i agree i loved it i thought it was really i thought it was really great so cute i'm so happy for them i'm happy for the success um of aaron foster as well for the show to take yeah right that must be like such a huge accomplishment totally and you can just feel the show like has their touch Mm -hmm. you know like just the comedic yeah some of like just the comedic timing of it 